Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get TVMate IPTV player to your Fire Stick or Android TV. First of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. Just go to search on your device, here it is, and in the search bar, start typing Unloader. As you can see, it already popped out for us at the bottom, so there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app. We click on the loader, and that's the app which we need to get to your device. However, after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we'll go to settings. Here they are. Scroll down to the bottom and go to My Far TV. Open it. Here we'll have to enable developer options for your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Far TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times. And do it fast, so let's do it. As you can see, now the button for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then we go to install unknown apps, and here turn that option on for the loader. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only from official Amazon App Store. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on your device. Here it is, let's open it. And there is the loader app, which we already got to the far stick. However, before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, we got a great application for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may have. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Canada right now. And from the moment we connect, all your internet traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online. And that's extremely important if we wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but would like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below this video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just get your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and type topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the best NordVPN offer, which is currently available. Or just scan the QR code, which you can currently see on the screen with a camera of your phone. It's also going to give you the same offer. And that's it. Now let's use the loader safely. Now let's finally open the downloader app. On the left side menu, make sure to select Home, that's really important. Then we have to click on that search bar right here. And then in the search bar, we'll need to enter a code, which is going to be 2, 8, 9, 0, and 7. So once again, the code is 2, 8, 9, 0, 7. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes. Because if you make a mistake, obviously the code is not going to work. Then we click on Go, and in a couple of seconds, a website is going to open for you. And now when the website has opened, let's scroll down a little bit until we see a list of categories. So here it is. And what we have to click on is the IPTV players category. So we click on it and then a list of apps is going to open. And what you have to click on here is the TVMate IPTV player. So let's click on it. Then if any ad opens up for you here, make sure to click on close because if you click on open, it's going to mess everything up for you. So click on close. Then a new web page is going to open, which you also have to scroll down. Keep scrolling until you see that download button, that's what we have to use, but if for some reason it does not work for you and the download does not start, you can always use the backup download link, which is just below the usual download button. So now let's click on download, and the load has started for us, usually it's really fast. Click on install right here, now we just need to wait a couple of seconds until the app gets installed, and after it was installed, do not click on open yet, instead press on done because here we have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't need anymore. So we click on delete, and then delete once again. Now let's go to the list of apps on our device, here it is, let's open it, scroll down, and there's the TVMate app which we just installed. Now I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote, there's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on move to front. This way TVMate app is always going to be at the very top of your application list, 
and it's going to be really easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Then once again, don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. And after that, let's open TV Mate app. And from here, it's really straightforward. We just need to click on Add Playlist. And then depending on what live TV provider you have, you would either click on Add a M3U playlist. There you just enter the link and then click on Next. Or if you have Xtreme code, you would select this option, enter the server address, your username, your password, click on Next, and the playlist is going to be added to your TVMate application. And pretty much that's it. That's the easiest way to get TVMate app to your Fire Stick in 2024.